Sie können alles für Ihre Obstanlage tun. You can provide everything for your produce farm, but if you cannot provide enough water when your plants need it most, quality will suffer and so will their value on the market. Come with me to a fruit and vegetable farm near Koblenz and let me show you how successfully an automated irrigation system can pay off. The village of Dieblich in the Mosel Valley. The Scherhack family runs a very well managed modern farm producing a wide variety of vegetables and fruits which are either sold directly in the farm shop or delivered to nearby markets. However, the farm used to have one problem, water. Wir liegen hier im Bereich von Koblenz in einem Regentrockengebiet. This region of Koblenz is very dry. We only get 20 to 25 inches of rainfall per year. It's especially bad in the spring and summer. And whether we're talking about sweet cherries, apples or prunes, those are the most crucial periods for growth, when we need water badly to develop large fruit. So to improve future crops, we decided to set up an irrigation system that would cover the entire growing area of our farm. Um das in Zukunft besser bewerkstelligen zu können, haben wir uns dazu entschlossen, im Grunde im Gesamtbetrieb eine Beregnungsanlage bauen zu lassen. However, there was one condition. The system could not cause any additional work for the farmers. Everybody was already busy enough. So the Scherhack family opted for an automatic wireless irrigation system, radio controlled via cell towers. It's the most reliable way of using a data network to control an irrigation system. The farm has many different sized parcels of land, spread over two different elevations, one in the valley and one in the hills. These areas need water at separate times, and they too had to be supplied by automated remote control. In fact, the ability to regulate the control cycle easily was very important to us. It is clear now, after one year in operation, that we could not have managed it successfully without a fully automated irrigation system. We simply don't have the time to operate all the valves manually. The automatic control operation is based on a continuous collection of data. A weather station in the middle of the farm monitors temperature, amount of rainfall, solar radiation, wetness of leaves. Sensors near the roots of the trees measure the soil's moisture at depth of 1, 2 and 3 feet. All this information is transmitted by radio link to the central unit where it's augmented with data from the nationwide weather forecast. The main antenna at the farm office is in contact with all stations in the field. Here we are at a relay antenna which captures signals from our central computer and relays the signals to magnetic valves which are opened and closed here in this manhole to supply water as required by the individual control cycles. The system is simple and easy to operate. It's all about achieving a good yield good quality and good sizes of fruit. For example, the international standard for minimum size of sweet cherries is 26 millimeters or 1 inch. But of course every farmer wants to produce larger fruit that will bring higher prices. How did the system perform in that regard? Um, was we gesehen haben, war, dass wir trotz dieser extremen Trockenheit even in the extremely dry conditions last year, our entire harvest of sweet cherries achieved the desired standards. That was absolutely essential and our whole objective in adopting a fully automated, remote-controlled irrigation system. Compare that with non-irrigated farms, where crops were often not even worth harvesting, because the cherries did not reach the minimum standards for marketing. So the first year of operation confirmed that the Scherhack family had made the right decision. Effective irrigation saved the quality of fruits and prevented the farm from financial losses. Moreover, the precise control system combined with highly efficient drip irrigation enabled them to use just one well without the need to build a reservoir. Of course, an irrigation system of that technical standard is a big investment for a family farm, but it can pay out quickly. Sie haben mit eigenem Kapital hier alles uh you invested your capital in that system. When do you expect it to pay out if you factor in quality as well as yield? 
Das ist eine gute Frage, Herr Razavi. Ähm, die ersten Planungen waren im Grunde... Well, the whole planning started with that calculation. We set the objective to amortize the cost of the system in 10 to 15 years. Meanwhile, we learned more. Due to intense use made necessary by the extreme weather, we benefited greatly from the system being completely automated as well as from the whole irrigation technique. So already now, I predict that our investment will probably pay out in five years due to higher yields and higher quality. The next years will show maybe the irrigation system will pay out even earlier. Iripart. Wireless Irrigation.